All right, welcome back. Welcome back to the second episode of the Warbit series. This is George speaking. Yeah, it was meant to be weekly. Yeah, life got in the way of that. But we will be attempting to play this at least once a week or once every two weeks from now on, provided that my life doesn't get completely crazy. On the last episode, I got annoyed with the in-game narrative and then I won the level very unconvincingly. Let's continue and see if I am any less annoyed by the Sector 2-2 story. So let's dive in. Right. Let's just wait for it to load. Uh, it's Fog of War. Everyone hates Fog of War. Um, oh, I mean, this is really tedious, isn't it? This is so... Okay, so you can only see stuff when you're next to it. They're going to be out there creeping around. Fair enough. All right, I understand that. Let's get going. Um, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to move here. Because there's a... See, there's a cheeky thing in there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go get the gunship. And I'm going to go and do some attacking on that. Then... Hmm, what am I going to do? I think I'm going to... You see, if I go there, because it's got its attack range, you can check its attack range. And so if I get too close, it's going to end up hitting me. So what I'm going to do... Is I'm going to attack using the probe to try and get myself ahead. And then, okay, I'm going to move my artillery up the road. Because I know that they can't quite see it. So I'll do that. Then what I'll do is... Probably gonna just get these infantry up high for the meantime because then that should give me a bit more coverage. Then I'm gonna move the tank into position and I'm gonna move the APC there, supply everyone, and then I'm gonna go to the menu. I'm gonna end my turn. There we go. Oh, they're taking my cities. They are taking my citizens. That's not very nice of them. But that's okay. Because I can go and do that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and hide this recon unit in there. This is a classic Advanced Wars tactic if you've not played Advanced Wars before. Which is basically the good old reveal extra terrain by using one of the nice forests to hide in. And then go and deliver some serious damage. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to let the... I'm going to get the missile unit a bit further up the road. What I'm going to do is try and draw them into an attack on that. I'm going to go drop down there. I'm going to keep that one out of the way. Menu. I'm going to end the turn. Yes. Solid start so far. But they are taking my cities back. So I'm going to be in a bit of trouble there. See, that's gone quite nicely. Because I think I can hit that one. Then, can I use that to attack? Yeah, that's gone. That's done. Then what I can do is use that to attack there then I can use that to attack there I can then do want to attack that mm. attack that de -de -de -de. attack that what I'm going to do I'm going to hit that there yeah it's a good shout and then I'm moving these guys into position. I'm going to unload that guy there. I'm going to begin some capturing. Because I know that the enemy can see me. And so therefore, he will come and attack me. There we go. That's the end of this for this little army. End my turn. Come at me, bro. Yeah. 
so I think looking at this that guy is in attack range which he is indeed eat that that's uh he's in attack range of that as well oh beauty um I'd assume that this fine gentleman is going to be in attack range there as well so I'm going to go hit there I'm going to go hit there I'm going to capture because I can see that this is this is good this is much more solid than my last episode's performance last time out I was kind of too busy explaining what was going on to actually go to war so I'm going to move there resupply the only concern I've got is have I spread myself too thin too thinly. I'm not, not saying too thin. It makes me sound like I'm a fan of sharks. I have spread myself too thin. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm really sorry about that, everyone. Um, but anyway, okay, this is going well. So, ugh, that's the one slight quibble I've got with the controls. I just keep making that mistake. So there's shoals. Those little things there, you're going to be able to hide. But so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go out into the ocean because that's going to be a little bit harder to get in there. Then I'm going to continue prosecuting. I shall prosecute the war. And then just sort of see what happens. Right menu and turn job done job very much done here boys I have a feeling I've got a feeling ooh, ooh. Um, yeah that's not what I'm gonna be doing so yes yeah, so I have a feeling that this is the last enemy perhaps not though so I'm gonna just be a little bit careful just in case. I'm going to try shifting on round. Moving on up. Moving on. Cool. And then I'm going to use this guy to have a bit of shooting just to try and do a bit more damage. And then menu. I'm going to end that turn. There we go. Yeah, that's the last one, I think. And there we go. That's not actually ended it. Oh no, there's another one. I've been too cocky. Which I can only assume means that we are. Somewhere. Okay, I'm assuming that there's someone hidden. Yeah, I'm strongly assuming that there's someone going to be hidden in the south of this map. So I'm going to just move my forces around. I'd take a guess. I wouldn't want to totally risk it, but I'd hazard a guess. There's someone here in this tree round there in front, either on the headquarters or in the tree down there. I would guess it's an artillery unit because they generally tend to mimic our deployments a bit. So, see, there we go. I've probably actually put myself in a bit of a bad position there. that guy there so the heavy guy so the idea I've got to try and take that out because I'm going to struggle a bit unless I can get this rocket launcher down the road quickly is that because I've moved my tank in I went in too aggressively oh no so they're gonna actually do a bit of damage to me which is a bit of a bummer but not as much as I thought it was gonna be actually because um, I totally forgot that I 
totally forgot that everything's okay. And also just I'm just speeding things up by getting everyone in nice and tight. Cool, I'll get that one capturing as well just because I fancy some extra pointage. And I'm nearly there over the line, so I'm just gonna end my turn there. This is looking like a pretty solid victory. And boop. Kaboom. Shifty little troll. You don't understand. Yeah, you see. Okay, uh, some terrible banter aside. I managed to give myself a slightly better rank. Probably would have been a bit quicker if I had correctly assumed that there was going to be some more hidden enemies. But we basically at the point where we're on to the next level. And so next time out, we'll be hitting Sector 2-3. That's been it for me for this time. Catch you later, everyone.